Hey guys, Edog Place here, bringing you guys another video today. As you guys can see, we're hopping back onto Tap Searches for the second video of the day. Um, we have been away for four days, so we've earned 238.68 bad billion, so we've earned a little bit of money. Uh, day one reward is going to be another bar bronze crate, sorry. It's seven gems, so I mean, basically now we're just going to be saving our gems until there is another event on so we can spend uh, and get some great, great crates. Um, but we can activate one of these. Now we're at a 2.8 times jungle boost for four and a half hours. We could do some upgrades, but it's it's getting quite expensive. I don't really care about the duration because, I mean, these videos are only 15 minutes long. But it's the boost that would be helpful. Um, we can go ahead and do that one. Let's do that, and then let's do that. There we go. So we're at three times profit boost for four and a half hours. Still have 41 gems. Um, get new a jungle visor. We are going to do that, but let's spin our, the fortune wheel. There is no event on currently, so we don't have a whole lot to do, but um, we still got quite a bit to do. Spin for advisors, things like that. And two in a row, we've got money, and they know I don't like money. Three in a row, we've got money. Come on, please just be nice to me. 100 golden tickets, fine. It's okay, it's not a lot of golden tickets, but it's okay. And five gems, not too bad, because we just spent quite a few. We just spent 19 gems. Um, oh, another ad, okay. So we still need to spin for Jungle Advisor. We don't have two to do, which kind of sucks. Um, daily quest those earn one profit multiplier. Spend gold tickets in Earth one time. And earn 10 keys. Earn 10 keys might be a little difficult. That one might be a little difficult to do. Especially because there's no event where you're getting a ton of tickets at a time. Or uh, keys at a time. And a Jungle 1 star. Don't think we have this guy. But we probably do. Duplicate, okay. Um, times 16 times tap profits in Ribo. Didn't know. Sure, whatever. That's that's how you say it. Okay, that's that's how you say it. Um, spin for an advisor here. We're not going to be spending Astro Bots or Monkey Bot. Or sorry, we're not going to be using or like activating Astro Bots or Biz Bots. The Earth and Space guys. Oh, we got a two star. Um, two star new, ten times more astrobots activated. So not going to be activating them because, yes, I do have quite a free, quite a few free uses. But it's like, it's not really worth it. I don't care if I have money in these places. It really doesn't bother me one bit. So why would I spend them? I mean, yeah, they're fairly common, but why would you use them anyways? Until we get like twenty of them, then I think I'm going to hold off, keep them, so we can be doing activations quite often. So I don't want to use them like crazy, but I think, I mean, if we're anywhere close, we might as well, or if we have like 8 or 10 maybe, let's go ahead and use one uh, on jungle. So we got a duplicate now being leveled up to level 2, 5.5 times critical tap chance in capitalist hill. Not ever going to really use them ever again, but let's see how close our monkey bots actually are. So monkey bots... That's a decent increase. I mean, we have five of them, so let's just... Ah, no. I was going too quick. I didn't activate the other guys that we had. Whatever. So we're earning 5.4 bad million per second. Five bad million per second. And that's all we can afford with our monkey bots. So we're making five bad million per second. We are going to do an act... Er, we're going to get that milestone. Don't think... Well, we can afford a couple more upgrades, it seems like. We need 10.5 bajillion. So I guess we're getting a little bit closer, but it definitely is taking a super, super long time to progress in this. I mean, it's episode 41, and we still haven't even got to the fourth place. It's getting a little bit ridiculous. It's getting quite long. It's dragging out quite long. But I mean, it is the last place, so it should last a while. Because after we're done this, there's nowhere to go. I mean, they need to keep on updating. And I think what they should do is they make... So if they have a new place, if they add a new place, they should make this place jungle a little bit or easier so more people can get to the new place. Because even if they do add a new place right now or in a month, I probably won't be able to get to it because of how hard this place is. It's hard to progress. I mean, we're not getting a ton of money. I, I don't know. I mean, we're not playing every day, obviously. But even if I was, I think it would still take quite a while 
um, to get even past this, but we have three places. We've had three places for the past 41 episodes. We haven't bought a new place in forever. It's been so long. And it's, it's getting super expensive to start doing that, which kind of sucks. Um, but, but we do have 47 gems. Let's see. Oh, one day bananas. We have one of those for free. Ooh, how much? 204 babillion. Us uh, can't afford any milestones here. So what if we can there? It's a day worth of bananas. We can only buy milestones here. I think this place is our second best. Let's check. Oh, we completed that quest. Okay. Uh, 649 zillion, 1 bad million, and 33 bad million. So, it, this is the best. This is the second best. This is the worst. So, we've earned one key. We need nine more from tapping. I don't know if we're going to be able to tap this much. But, guys, I definitely think we do need another series to start. I'm going to start looking for some games to play. Um, please leave some suggestions down below in the comments because now that I am making double uploads, uh, we're kind of running out of games. I mean, not necessarily running out of games, but we're going to be getting bored of a lot of them. So I think we need to kind of spice it up with something different. Hopefully something that's going to blow up. I mean, it's obviously the goal, but let me know if there's any games that you guys want me to try. Preferably like a tag tycoon game like this. Um, something like Clash of the Clans, I guess, maybe... Um, that might be a little bit harder to progress and level up if you're only playing like once every five days. Might take a super long time to do that. And especially with a 12 minute episode, sometimes you could do two, maybe three battles because I was doing Clash of Clans before. Maybe we should go back to that. I don't know. Leave some comments and some suggestions down below. Um, I mean, preferably a brand new game, maybe one that I haven't played before. I mean, obviously you guys won't know, so just leave any Tycoon game that you guys are interested in right now down below in the comments. I've been thinking about playing Fortnite, but it's, I don't know, I maybe I'm going to do it every once in a while, I'll do a stream, but it's just, it's not, it's not worth it because no one's really going to be watching any videos that I post on Fortnite. Maybe the odd person will, yeah, I'm not going to get as many views as normal, no. But uh, there's so many better players to watch that no one would really watch me. That's that's the difficult part of trying to grow as a YouTuber. You need to you need to have a lot of time and patience and stuff. And because I already have a community here built on games like this, why would I restart that? Like, I started playing phone games because I thought to myself, I was like, there's like let's just say there's a thousand people posting YouTube videos on Call of Duty because Call of Duty Fortnite this was back before Fortnite was a thing. I had my YouTube channel before Fortnite was Battle Royale wasn't even really a thing. So why why would I follow people and post videos on Call of Duty? Why would I try to be the best Call of Duty YouTuber when there's millions of Call of Duty YouTubers that are already super super good? Why wouldn't I do something that not a lot of people do and that I could think I could do better? Oh Sorry, low low battery. Why why wouldn't I do that? If there's not very many people playing, like I searched up a couple phone games. I saw people with a like a really really crackly microphone and things like that, and I mean didn't really know what to do. They, like their videos were a minute long. Like I feel like I could improve on that. So I did it. I bought the right equipment, things like that. I I mean I have a phone to play the games on. I have a microphone to record my voice. I have a webcam. I have a good enough computer. I have this stuff and I'm making pretty good YouTube videos, I think. And I think that if there was a larger audience, obviously I would have like a larger amount of people that wanted to watch phone games. I think I would definitely be a lot bigger than where I am. Uh, still need five more. I don't know if we're going to be able to complete it this episode or just, we might just have to skip. We do have 55 quest skips, so we do have a lot. That's really not going to make a difference. Um, but yeah, I wouldn't mind doing the odd Fortnite stream, but uh, yeah, I definitely don't plan on doing it all the time and uh, making YouTube videos on it and stuff as well. Because obviously, I'm not the best Fortnite player in the world. I don't get dull, like I have, I don't win every second game I play. Like I'm not that good. And to make YouTube videos on that, that would be very, very time consuming because, I mean, now with all the big YouTubers and how good they are, you almost have to get a W to post, like a win, to post it on YouTube or else no one's really going to watch it. So, I mean, for me, that might take me a day, like, of grinding. I'm not the best. Some days I win 10 times, some days I win zero. So, I mean, I, some days there would be a YouTube video and there'd 
some days there wouldn't be so it's a little too unpredictable here i don't have to be amazing at the game i progress if i want to get better i play offline i do things like that like i don't have to i don't know it's a little more difficult and i mean i'm not not doing it because it's difficult it's i'm doing it this way because i think i'm going to be more successful that's that's how I'm looking at it and that's the reason why I'm playing phone games instead of playing Fortnite cuz obviously I've I play Fortnite all the time and like in the past 24 hours I've probably played 15 hours of Fortnite. My buddy came over and we were grinding a lot like we've been playing a lot of Fortnite. So uh, yeah, I mean if if I could record every game I had and just uploaded them but I mean you always need to be talking and stuff like that and I know a lot of you guys probably don't think it's time not time uh, it's a lot of work to, like to be talking and like if I make 10 videos and I talk th all throughout the video and it's a 30 minute video and I die every time I mean that's very very difficult to do because obviously I mean if you guys try talking for in front of a camera like this I mean I'm starting to get a little bit tired already like just talking a lot like this for 11 minutes like that it starts to get tiring and especially when you have to do it eight times like if you don't get a win then you get frustrated I don't know it's a lot I think I'm gonna be more successful doing what I'm doing that's why I'm doing it but guys I'm gonna have to end this episode here if you guys have enjoyed please go ahead and smash the like button and leave a comment down down below with any suggestions of games that you guys want me to try out I will check them out might not post a video on them but I want to check them out anyways subscribe if you guys are new around here and I will see you in the next one peace out